a smart cookie, Jesse. Of course I am! No, not the whole time, you nitwit! The real Voss would never have survived in my sea temple that long. I am disappointed, Jesse. You obviously just don't have what it takes to really be my friend, my partner. Such a pity. Such a waste. Oh, come on, it was kind of exciting, right? Sort of a surprise reveal? But you... lost. See, she may not have the skills, but that is a terrific attitude. Your attitude, on the other hand? Oh, well... There's nothing that hurts more than broken hopes. I made this for you. Just for you. And how do you repay me? You cheated! How could you do this to me? Oh, that's adorable. They're mad they got manipulated. I should be mad that I had to waste all that time looking like that crusty old adventurer. I gave you so many chances! It hasn't all been to waste. No, no! You might not be worthy. Technically, Petra here was the winner. Oh, don't get me wrong. There are quite a few flaws we'll have to work through, but we'll get there. In time? Greetings, tiny people. I am the admin. Sorry. That was probably really loud to your pathetic, tiny ears. I wish to speak with Jesse, the gauntlet bearer. It's hard to hear your tiny voice from down there. Come, speak with me face to face. <clears throat> I would like to proceed, Gauntlet Para. Do not test my patience. Ah, there you are, Jesse. I loved what you did with the Witherstorm. Awesome stuff. Oh, ho, ho, ho. this is going to be perfect. You've got the knack to tempt you down to the sea temple. But now, your true test begins. It is time you no! fight. during our last little battle, super epic. Just couldn't stay away. Well, that giant... Prismarine Colossus. <laughs> just a construct. Rolled it up for the occasion. Pretty fun, right? I just thought it'd be a little easier to talk like this. Well, it's kind of cuddly, right? Oh, come on. Come on, don't do me like that. You have to admit, you've been having a little fun along the way. All those guardian fish, the temple, Hey, see, you four went into my temple, back out alive. Heroes, you're perfect for my creations. Perfect. Got a new challenge for you. Trust me, you're gonna love it. That's a diamond class wave of doom and destruction headed right for town. <laughs> Pretty good, right? 
been working on that one. <laughs> Innocent or incentive? I don't know. Seems like they've got you pretty motivated. Ahem. <clears throat> Your town will be trapped in eternal snowy night, forever plagued by deadly waves of mobs, until you recapture that clock. <laughs> she is cute, isn't she? Everyone get away from my llama. No. Jesse, my rival. Should have known I would find you here. <clears throat> Hush, I'm talking. I've dreamt of challenging you again since our last confrontation. Jacques, was it? As in the legendary champion? My beautiful city is currently covered in a hideous coat of snow. That's what. I came out to investigate, and surprise, surprise, it's you. If you're smart, you'll undo whatever it is you did and put things right again. I... no! Just... I am going to fix it. All right, let's say I believe you. I suppose I'll just have to find a way to fix it. It's my world too, after all. You'll see, I'll fix it all on my own. I don't need any of you losers. Well, I have never been so offended. Not in my whole life. Yeah. Oh, oh, wasn't the coolest? Oh, no. Miss filing your acacia wood during material organization week isn't the coolest. That was... That was a stripe too far. But just because I'm not some sword-swinging meathead, they think they can just walk all over me. They, they think they, they look at me and my, well, my, my skinny little arms, and, and they think they know me. They think they know me? Well, they are wrong. Dead wrong! I mean, I have been an embarrassment sometimes, but it stops here. It ends today. And I... I, <clears throat> I guess I'm done. Sorry. <sighs> I'm all right. I'm okay. <sighs> I'm so sorry. I'm okay. Really. Just getting my adventure legs. I'll be better in a minute. <sighs> now, I think you need to give him a little more credit. We were talking about how sometimes you need to just ignore people that are being difficult. Now, Jesse... <laughs> Jesse knows all about that. Oh, yeah. Jesse's had to go on adventures with all sorts of people. Well, I suppose we should get back to figuring this room out, huh? He really reminds me of us. You know, back in the day, eager to make his mark. Always ready for whatever's around the next corner. Yeah. I learn from the best. <laughs> <sighs> okay. Okay. Yeah. I guess I did, huh? Uh, help! Crushing! Lungs. Look at that. Punctual and kicking butt. Nice! <laughs> hey, glad to see you remember how to use your sword. I was worried you'd gotten rusty. I can't even imagine that life. Managing people, signing papers. Ugh. Except I'm gonna have a hard time being seen with someone wearing such dingy armor. What is that? Iron? Well, you sure showed me. I gotta say, I really appreciate you making it on time. It means a lot to me. I sometimes worry you don't have time for your friends anymore. I know you enjoy your job or whatever. Not that I'm trying to make you feel guilty or anything. Okay, now you're just trying to flatter me. But, uh, can't help but notice that we're missing one, two, three. Is writing, I figured. Man, our friends have gotten lame. I swear, if our old fans saw what we're doing now, yeah, that's a good point. At least we've got the cool people here. We'll worry about them later, I guess. We gotta hurry. Welcome to Jack and Nerm's Adventure Emporium. You push the button. Very, very brave. <laughs> there are lots of signs in the world. Not everyone's brave enough to follow them. The warriors of the Whispering Mountain call me the Stab Walker. The Air Titans of the East call me he who slashes like thunder. But you may call me... Jack. So, what can I do for you today? Desert Temple? Woodland Mansion? Oh, uh, wow, huh? Crazy glove you got there. Not that I've ever seen one before. 
It uh, looks real crazy, though. Crazy stuff. Found it on top of a creepy bottomless pit, right? Spitting out monsters. <sighs> you should have never picked up that gauntlet. It's not for us mortals to tamper with. And that made you want to pick it up more? That pit, it's as deadly as they come. And that symbol you saw was the symbol of the structure block. Legend says it was a mighty tool that could grow civilizations like seeds, create cities in the blink of an eye. You need one of those to close your pit. Jesse, dude! Did that? Righteous times. Thought I'd try settling down for a while, though? Like, I love danger and daring do as much as the next person. Yeah, dude, it is awesome! Letting everybody be themselves, super individualistic, house over there that looks like a squid. Righteous. Between you and me, I am worried that I won't, like, fit in here. So many rad builds, awesome people. I really want to make, like, a good first impression, you know? Which I thought might be helped if my front yard had a statue by the one and only Jesse. Hey, hey, hey! This is going to be so cool! Scoop up that clay over there and let's get to business! That is some sweet work! Nice! Oh, Jesse, dude, thanks! Well, it is an honor, mi amigo, and don't be a stranger, okay? Wink, get back here! Leave Jesse alone! Thought we'd give this town of yours a trap? Yeah, and I can't believe how many people are here! And the stories of this place sounded awesome. Oh, Wink. Here, Jesse, give him a bone and he'll calm it right down. Aw, see? He likes you. Nah, hang on to them. I've got tons. You never know when you're gonna need to tame a wolf. Yeah, what Stampy said. Anyway, our place is by the gate. Hello there, Jesse. I was wondering when we'd run into each other. It's quite lovely. Um, the thrill of adventure, I guess. I imagine you're terribly busy, so we won't keep you. But you should come and see what we're working on, because it's pretty cool. Oh, that's okay. I get it. You have your life, and so do I. Radar, don't be so formal. Cut it out with all the sir and ma'am stuff. So, what's up? Petra will never let you hear the end of it, though. Well, my friends and I give each other strength. That day is no different. Stella. I've never met her before, right? Sorry, but you are not my rival. Even my B-list villains are way scarier than you. That's not why we're here, Stella. We have other business. Don't make me get tough here, Stella. You know what Petra wants. We're not leaving without that sword. Wait, what? You live here? I'm not letting her get away with this. We're getting even. We'll roll in, fight the bodyguards, snag the sword, get out again. Piece of cake. <laughs>